Hello everyone, Crystal Fisher here. We're going to finish the transit system in this part. This is part 7 of my Let's Play of Daxter. And, um, yeah. The music, I like the fact they're using a vibraphone. That's one cool thing. Now, not much to go, go on this level. I basically quit out of sort of half frustration of keep failing this and like having to redo the sections again. Um, but, more importantly, I wanted to split it so we can split it with the boss as well, because there is a boss coming up too, which is uh, uh, the Hive Queen, and it's actually one of those bosses where you've got to do it right, otherwise everything goes to shit. Okay, there you go. That sounds like a really general thing to say, but I, it's hard to explain, but yeah, you really you really got to be uh, careful with it, and you got to, well, there's like a particular method to in order to beat it properly. No, no. No, I am seriously sick of this. I do not want to do this fucking section again. Yeah, okay, there you go. Died. And... Gotta get this, these pricks again. Seriously, I feel like I've done this loop now like 700 times. And we've just we've knocked this skull gem into the wall. Holy shit. So basically, I've glitched it to the point where we actually can't get anything, so I'm going to have to drop off and electrocute myself. Drop the drop the toaster in the bathwater. Don't be in here, you idiot. You, you're literally locking yourself, like, forcing yourself into the wall. Okay, there you go. 20 out of 28. These fucking... It's the speed. It Seriously, it genuinely feels faster than the other times. It, it has to be. I can't be crazy. I guess maybe we just, just go left to right like this. Maybe maybe we'll be able to do it then. Alright. There we go. Whoa. There you go. Oh. That's another thing. Don't die. Okay. Make this jump first. Oh. Or not. Okay. This should be it now. This has to be it. Could you go in the other side? Oh shit, only three left. So you gotta, remember, duck under these. You can't jump through them. It may look like you can jump through them. You know, it's like, uh, we can't go under it. We can't go over it. Oh no, we have to go through it. Yes. 60 out of 60. And that was the last one. How absolutely convenient was that? Oh my god, and two levels in a row, guys, we've actually been able to 100%. What a fucking lucky day. A glorious, glorious day. Glorious. Now I will give in. I will give in. I can't believe I actually made an NXT. Ugh. I know. I know. I, I actually made a, re a WWE reference. I know. It's it's just so sacrilege of me. Uh, you know, Bobby Roode's cool. He's an XTNA guy, so I respect him. Respect him. Okay. Whoa. That almost died, and we're done. Look at this. This is useless. Don't even need that. Well, actually, kind of do. But look at it. How fucking awesome is this, lads? Look at this. It's a Zuma train chase. Now we won't call it a part. Like we won't call it train chase. I'll put it in the description. Um, but I won't call it like a part. Like it isn't really a part. Do you know what I mean? It, even though it's like this section that you're about to see. Look at this. A train. How cool is this? How freaking cool is this? This is like so. It's like feels like Jack and Daxter, but like not in a more like platformery way or something like that. It's it's just it's great. What a, what a cool what a cool little bit bit. But yeah, it's not like a full level. It's basically the train is uh, chasing us. <laughs> Couldn't be more obvious there, but just a short little section before our boss and if you keep getting hit and don't hit the things that you'll see this train start to approach see see the trains coming the train is very close so all right, we go through here oh it just sort of I didn't, I didn't press anything but it didn't seem to work anyway go through here and if we pause no unpour wait, here when the music changes hive queen one okay so, this is Hive Queen 1, aka the first boss. We'll start by hitting it. Look at that, music starts perfectly with that. <laughs> to that music. Okay. Oh. 
So, no skull gems here, because this isn't like a collectible level, if you know what I mean. Like, there's no, um, there's no, like, what's the word? Um, yeah, there's no, like, skull gems. There's no, you know, you can't, you basically, ca I think you can technically come back to this level. Um, can you do the boss again? Maybe not, though. Even if you, like, return to it through the transit system, you might not be able to do the boss, because, and, like, what's the point? It's, it's already dead type thing, yeah, so. Anyway, the trick is with this, is to do this. Okay, not that. Okay, hold up. I'm s stuffing up here. This is weird. This is really weird. The trick is... You need to get close. This is bullshit. I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm confused now because the way I saw people do this boss, it so sort of, you have to spray him with, um, or the queen, so you have to spray her with yeah, the bug spray because she's like allergic to it. And if you die enough times, which I did when I was like playing this like, casually, wasn't really, like focusing, I was listening to a Survivor Know It All's podcast with uh, Rob Sessanino and uh, Stephen Fishback, but um. Yes, I wasn't really focusing, and then at one point, like, Dax is like, I think she's allergic to bug spray, you know, so, although, that's the thing, I tried to hit it with the bug spray, and it didn't properly work, so that's kind of annoying, hold up, okay, hit her again, now, okay, let's just lay down a safe state. I know that seems like cheating, but I just want to see what happens here because something I feel like we, we're doing it wrong. I think that's, that's our problem. There you go. See, I hit it. I... See, I, I definitely, I definitely sprayed this piece of shit. Yeah, I def, I definitely, I definitely sprayed it. That doesn't make any sense to me. Yeah, I'm, I'm... Something something doesn't... It's like, we have to... Do we have to chase or something? For a certain amount of time? See, if we do that, we seem to get hit. Ah, there we go. That's, that's stupidity. That's stupidity on my behalf. That's very fucking obvious. We just have to wait. We just have to wait a little bit. Yeah, I don't know why. What was it? Okay, that's that's why. Then. Okay, see. Look, here we go. Do it again. So you go away a bit, and then it seems to basically be in a be further away, and then it'll do the shooting thing. There we go. There we go. My pro you know what my problem is? I wasn't walking far enough away. So he, uh, so she wasn't resorting to do that. She was just doing the thing where she like jumps on you. See like this? She's only doing that. So I was never able to get it. That's 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 my own fault there. See that's pretty cool, look at that. You can get it like by doing sort of an aerial assault like that, see? Alright. Now she's gonna do some big jumpy thing. You know, this whole bit reminds me a little bit of that boss in, um, you know, in Ratchet and Clank when you were in that nebula, like, 900 or 9, you know, it was like the one with the Blarg planet and you play as Clank and... Yeah, uh, there you go. Shit. I'm really stuck. Oh, oh, yeah. That's my dad's home. Father is home. I'll be right back. Okay, and I'm back. I, uh... Dad got home and, uh, okay, we're nearly there though, we're nearly there. Alright, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Alright, nearly done. I had some uh, Indian food for dinner, it was very nice. Alright, do the jump. And there we go. Oh, no, one more hit. Hive Queen 2, I can't remember where Hive Queen 2 is actually, I'm trying to think. Uh, oh shit, don't, don't let this be the end. There we go. It's the end for her instead. I'm trying to think where the second one is, because I know that there are at least two. I think it might be, like... I remember it being in, like, a bigger setting. Like, I felt like a bigger arena. But I've actually forgot. Um, yeah, I have to... Well, we'll look forward to it. We'll look forward to it. Already thinking about the second boss, and we haven't even finished this one. But, alright, guys. 
let's wrap this up. Here we go. Head up here, come on. And the next level is... I believe it's... Wait, where the, is it going to go up? Oh, whoops. My bad. Um, yeah, the next level, I think, I think we're going to be... I think, I think it's a strip mine. That is going to be awesome. Oh, it didn't, didn't he already mention it? Yeah, see, my memory. Short-term memory loss, probably. Or maybe not. Okay, here we go. What took you so long, Dexter? You didn't wreck the transit authority, Zoomer, did you? Oh, well, never mind. We've been given access to the power station. Head up there. I've got a distress call from the strip mine. Oh, no, that's good. Okay, it was mentioned there. Yeah, okay, it must have been from when I played it before. I'm getting my days, weeks, and months mixed up. I'm... I'm off the I'm off the freaking rails right now. All right, guys, have a look at this before we start the next part. Look at this, guys. Authentic. Seriously, look. It's the place. I mean, like it's like the same. Basically, very, very, very similar. Um, I believe there's probably like little minor differences, you know, graphical differences, of course. But honestly, that is so damn cool. If you ask me. So, oh shit. This this is really annoying because it's. It's sort of awkward the way you have to actually go over, go over it. Like, okay, you got to sort of get the right gap, and then you, you see the problem is, you, it's like the problem is is that I, I'm, you know when I did it before, I did it in the first go. It's because they purposely make the standing really awkward for some reason in this in this. Uh, see, look, it's like not the right height every time. There you go, that should be the right height. There we go. And done. Okay, guys, in the next part, we're going to go to the strip mine. Looking forward to it. See you then. And thank you, as always, for watching.